Hi, my name is Michael Blake. I'm a professor in the Department of Philosophy. And in the fall, I'm going to be teaching Philosophy 102, which is Contemporary Moral Problems. This is one of my favorite classes to teach. I tend to specialize in moral issues, especially issues that deal with elected politics, uh, international relations, migration policy, other areas where there's a lot of heat and not a lot of actual conversation that tries to figure out together what it is we actually believe. We're facing a world right now that has a huge amount of division and a huge amount of confrontation, but not a lot of actual sustained thought about why we believe the things we do and what we could do to better understand our opponents and ourselves. Philosophy 102 is kind of intended as one way in which we might slow down and start thinking about these issues. My favorite definition of philosophy is that it's thinking in slow motion. Ordinarily, just to get through the day, we make a huge number of assumptions about the world and ourselves and the values that motivate us. And uh, in philosophy, we slow down. We see what can be said for the other side, and we figure out how it is that we actually justify the things we believe to ourselves and others. So in Philosophy 102, we start by reading some great theorists. We read uh, philosophers like John Stuart Mill, Immanuel Kant, uh, Jeremy Bentham, other people who have had a lot to say about what makes right actions right and wrong actions wrong. But then, in the more interesting part of the course, we apply these to issues that are live and that are confronting us right now. Issues ranging from sexual ethics to abortion to the death penalty to racist speech on campus. We see what philosophy can and cannot teach us about these issues. I think philosophy is a huge amount of fun if you do it in the right spirit, in the right way, and you treat it as a conversation, which is how I try to teach it. If we were in a normal environment sitting around the table, I would try to convince you that philosophy could be a part of your life going forward. But since I'm not here with you, and since I've now been forced to learn about my Macintosh, I've decided to make a trailer on iMovie. I've just discovered this program this afternoon, and I am terrible at it, but I enjoy it. So without further ado, here's my trailer for Philosophy 102. Mm -hmm.